Hey guys, it's your boy we back with more Mountage Red content and we have the patch notes for the Gwen pool update. Uh, she's gonna be a villain so it's gonna be interesting if she takes over Mystique for the Alliance Battle uh, Extreme. Speed villain day or not. Let's take a look at what actually goes on. So we have the same Fagon Marvel future fight in this patch meet a hero who was transported into the Marvel Universe which is the worth of uh, which is the world of comic books. Gwen Poole the user who uh, the vast knowledge gained from the comic book had received a new uniform and a tier 4. Let's see. So she is a speed super villain now. We have the dark Gwenpool uniform for this girl. Well, in the world, universe, anything can happen. 1050, the usual cost uniform. Uniform effect now gives you 25% chain rate damage. <laughs> okay, that's cool. 25% critical rate as well as 4% additional peers damaging. Increase which she I think already has with the older uniform as well. The tier 2 passive guaranteed dodge rate 25% increase, 100% chance to penetrate, uh, super armor, all damage immune, and invincible. Not the shield, so she can be both hybrid as well. Skill damage 52% increase. Uh, I think this is the highest. Gene, I think, has 50%. I'm not sure if I, I could be wrong, but I think this is the highest skill damage in the game. If I'm not wrong, so 52% skill damage and 40% bonus damage increase from the tier 2 passive. Tier uh, 4 star passive gives you 5% of HP recovery every 2 seconds when you're below 90% HP, which is cool. The first skill has nothing, just the damage. Second skill has bleed, decrease recovery rate, paralyzed, so yes, she can be useful in ABX. Third skill has stun, fear, remove uh, active buff from target, paralyze again, uh, we have 50% de uh, defense down, 6% of HP recovery again for 1 second. And then we have 5 seconds of all damage immunity and some damage. The fourth skill has burn, so paralyze and burn on the kit, great. Bleed all uh, recovery rate again, decrease by 50%, invincibility for 5 seconds, that's pretty good, immunity and then invincibility, and we also have a 35% attack and defense buff along with that. Then we have burn on the 5th skill again, so multiple skill with burn, multiple skill with paralyze, which is great. Silent season I think is going on right now, I suppose, so we'll have to probably do the switch or maybe I think she's gonna be auto character, she is or not, uh, where can we see it, yeah. She's Justice, so I don't know, we'll have to see, we can maybe switch to Valkyrie, not Valkyrie, uh, who's that, maybe swap play with Mystique, uh, we'll have to see how that goes on, or you can just do that, so anyways, and we also have a damage accumulation on the basis of damaged uh, attacking, as well as 100% uh, character increase size, and then Basic attack also increased by 30% when you do that for 1.5 second. The 1.5 second, I think it's going to be a refreshing buff for maybe 6 or 7 seconds, I suppose, when the character size actually increases. And also we have defense increase with this as well. So the kit looks pretty good. Not something like extraordinary, but the 25% chain damage and some extra damage will definitely make her into the meta, hopefully. And the reason why I say it could be Mystique swap play is because I believe Mystique has silence on the kit. We might be doing the swap play with this girl because uh, unless you have Sin, I think you can use it. If you're using someone like, I think, Green Goblin, I think Goblin also has silence. Goblin gives you 45% damage increase to villain types for all the villain support if you have goblin then i suppose you can do that or maybe because mystique is a tier 4 gives you 40 percent damage so it's only a five percent damage difference between mystique and goblin so it depends i suppose i'll have to try i'll try both the teams i guess to see which one actually works out because silence is gonna be the only thing that might be a pain for gwenpool Apart from that, Paralyze and Burn Season, she can definitely take it. So, we look at it. Accumulation cancels Invincibility, Immunity, as well as a lot of damage. It looks like a meta uniform. Hopefully, we'll take a look at when we actually get it. And excited. <laughs> new meta? Absolutely. The new Striker skill, Kaboom! <laughs> Uh, we have physical attack increase 40% every 1 second. It goes up to 160%. So, stackable every 10 seconds. So basically a 160% attack boost, 
uh and uh, that is pretty good every 1 seconds for 10 seconds so every single second it will increase they did not show uh every 1 second increases 40% so i suppose in 4 seconds you should have 160% so after 4 second to 10 second about 6 to 7 seconds you will have a 160% physical attack boot which is huge so absolute looks like meta and hopefully it will be day one meta if so let's see i might do day one tier four for this girl and do the testing with mystique as well so i think she is also landing on the speed villain day on the mystique day itself tomorrow so let's take a look at what happens and definitely like going forward looking forward what we can do here anyways we have uh, more improvements the ignore targeting effect has been added to gwenpool's tier 3 skill so uh, yo that's good and ignore all targeting icon has been added to skill description the name of the uniform handsome pool mauer uniform has been changed to nice pool okay nice pool well that's good it was not handsome pool it was nice pool to begin with and that actually uniform is pretty good in world boss legend so it's all right i suppose and uh, yeah that's the all that's all for the patch note it's a very small patch just the gwenpool villain uniform i was not expecting this but she is here and looking forward i'm let honestly i'm excited and looking forward to the new meta testing hopefully she becomes meta and i will be doing some more testing uh versus gwenpool uh versus uh raven mystique tomorrow for alliance battle extreme absolutely it's gonna be awesome so let's see. Anyways, let me know what you think about the video. Let me know what you think about this uniform. And as always, if you do enjoy the content, I hope to see you again. Take care. I'll see you all in the next one.